Hello friends! In this video you'll see how have the actors of the movie American Graffiti 1973 changed. I will tell you about the characters of the film and also you'll see what's with the cast now. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. Let's go! Steve is a good friend of Kurt and Terry. He dreams of getting out of the small town he lives in, so he decided to go to college. He drives a car well and takes good care of it. He wears a watch on his left hand and can be recognized by his red hair, played by Ron Howard. Kurt Richard Dreyfus is a smart guy who was offered an unprecedented high scholarship by the college, and many are proud of him. But by nature, he is inclined to doubt everything and cannot decide on a responsible step. He also dreams of finding a beautiful girl. Carol is Judy's sister. She is in her teens, but is quite a brave girl and is not afraid to speak her mind and feel. Carol is sure that her parents don't need her, and even her only sister doesn't want to spend time with her. She was played by Mackenzie Phillips. Terry is a good friend of Steve and Kurt. He rides a white scooter, but he has difficulty parking neatly, and he can also drive a car. He is often teased and scoffed, he wears glasses and is not particularly popular with girls. They are always played by Charles Martin Smith. Laurie, Cindy Williams, is Steve's girlfriend who has warm feelings for him and she is as comfortable as possible to be around him. Negatively relates to the proposal of the guy to meet with others during the period of separation. Can be stubborn and persistent. Bob Falfa is a racing lover who wants to beat Joe and strip him of the king of racing title. Perfectly manages the car even with one hand and generally keeps confidently and calmly. He prefers to wear a light-colored cowboy hat. He was ported by Harrison Ford. Peg, Kathleen Quinlan, is a good friend of Laurie who tries to console, calm and support her in difficult times, but she can give tough examples for this. She is a girl with pretty features, having a small stature, beautiful shoulder-length hair and a good figure. Carlos is one of the members of the greasy gang led by Joe. He has a short stature, maintains a cool head and, like the other members of the gang, he wears the same jacket and smokes cigarettes. Loves listening to Wolfman. He was portrayed by Manuel Padilla Jr. Bobby is Wendy's good friend. She has red short curly hair and a beautiful blue eyes. Has a somewhat short temper and dislikes Skip Pullman. She drives on Red Beetle quite well and often likes to chew gum while driving. They're always performed by Lynn Mary Stewart. Mr. Wolf, Terence McGowan, works at a school and enjoys unprecedented popularity with girls who literally don't give him a pass, but still he tries to stay away from them as much as possible. Mr. Wolf can give students good advice and prefers to smoke cigarettes. Dick, Joe Spanner, dates Debbie and likes to call her pussy. He's very confident in himself and can easily disappear for three weeks without saying anything this about girl. He considers it's normal that he can come and go as he pleases and he should be readily expected. Butter works at the local Mel's drive-in as a waitress and delivers orders on roller skates. Also at work, she dresses in the appropriate uniform, a white shirt, black pants with red stripes and a hat of the same color. The roles performed by Jeanne Bellin. Station attendant John Dracci, who works mostly at night along with two other colleagues. He wears his signature uniform, white t-shirt, great shirt and light-colored jeans. He also knows a little about cars and can hear by ear whether there is a muffler in the car. Blonde in T-Bird is a beautiful girl who caught Kurt's attention. In addition to a pretty face, she also has beautiful, slightly curly hair and a charming smile. Blonde also drives confidently and likes to stir up interest. The role is performed by Susan Summers. 
The disc jockey works at a sound station near the town where Kurt and his friends live. He has a kind nature and is good at his job. This jockey likes to wear Hawaiian printed shirts, and he usually wears a watch on his right hand. He was ported by Waltzman Jack. Joe is at the head of gang of greasers. He is tall and athletic, although he has a bad habit of smoking cigarettes. He is often seen wearing black sunglasses, even at night. He doesn't like when they spoil the property of his friends. He was played by Bo Hopkins. Man at bar, guy, can immediately recognize when a person cannot drink, even if he says otherwise. He dresses not stylishly, but in ordinary simple clothes, and puts his hair in a dark tail hairstyle. Has a little overweight. He was played by Dell Close. Falfa's girl is a pretty pretty girl who often likes to hang out with cool guys in the evenings and ride with them in a car and often allows to them hug it and kiss. She wears a ring on her right hand. The role of Falfa's girl is played by actress Deborah Lee Scott. Wendy is Kurt's former lover who has maintained good friendship with him and knows his nature and what his aspirations are. Despite the fact that they broke up, she retains some feelings for him, can blurt out too much in secret. The role is played by Debbie Sellers. Mr. Gordon is the owner of a local establishment where you can play mini golf. He's a polite and tactful man who is happy to see Kurt and really rejoices in his success. Mr. Gordon is a family man and he wears a wedding ring. The role is performed by Scott Beach. Badass and his body stole Steve's car. He knows how to fight well and doesn't hesitate to use his strength to beat someone for fun. He's tall and has a strong build and dresses mostly in all black. The role of badass is played by actor Johnny Weissmuller Jr. John, Paul Matt, knows how to drive a car and often participates in street racing, in which he has earned a good reputation. He is mainly interested only in racing and finding a girl for fun, likes to play pranks on Terry, upset that Kurt and Steve are going to college. Judy is an acquaintance of Laurie. She likes to spend time with her friends walking or driving around the city until night, but it's not happy that sometimes she has to take her little sister with her, likes to walk with loose hair. She was played by Susan Richardson. Debbie is a beautiful girl with short white curly hair. She loves being compared to famous beautiful actresses like Connie Stevens and Sandra Dee. She prefers to wear a chain with a heart around her neck and tie her hair with a ribbon. She was played by Candy Clark. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please share it on social networks, like it, and of course subscribe to the channel.